Our Z-Lens intraocular lens is built to mimic this movement. In the Z-Lens resting state, the optic is bolted forward by haptics that are angled backwards. As the ciliary body relaxes, zonules pull the haptics flat, moving the optic backwards. When the ciliary body contracts, the haptics vault the optic forward. In this way, the Z-Lens moves back and forth in much the same way that the natural lens does during accommodation and disaccommodation. Before use, the Z-Lens is temporarily restrained in a flat configuration. When the natural lens becomes cloudy because of age, cataract surgery is required. During surgery, a hole is made in the capsular bag, called a capsularesis, and the natural lens is removed through it. The Z-Lens is then inserted into the now empty capsular bag with the restraining device holding it flat. The capsular bag collapses and adheres to the haptics of the Z-Lens. After a few weeks, the bag fibrosis and becomes stiff, which prevents movement. To restore movement, we activate the Z-Lens by cutting the capsular bag in between the haptics and releasing the restraining device. Activation can be done non-invasively with a YAG or femtosecond laser. After activation, the device will vault forward. Now that the IOL has been activated, it will mimic the movement of the natural lens by flattening out during disaccommodation and vaulting forward during accommodation.